Hey everybody, this is Ben and welcome back to Timber and Stone. We are here on day 37, early morning, so it should be a decently sized episode. And a spider has been spotted by Allison, which I do not believe I have a villager named Allison. So I discovered this spider is out here where this migrant must have spotted it. So let's let's watch. Oh, she's gonna she's gonna punch it to death. She's going way off the road. Bam! <laughs> nice punch, Allison. Could not walk to my desired target. Oh, yeah. There's the road. You're good. Do your thing. I got people working on the road a little bit here. Um, decided to cover up some of this ugliness. You know, just make this thing look nicer. Um, okay, this is all still dirt. So let's. Oh wow, look at that. I got that. <laughs> I'm glad that uh, counts as a road. Apparently. All right. So. Allison, level four engineer. She's not good at a whole hell of a lot else. Uh, but let's accept her anyway. Congratulations. Allison, what are you, level four engineer? I think I have a level four engineer already. Engineer. Sonaris Tinker. Yes, you are going to become infantry combat using training dummies. And you're gonna at least grab a sword. Just get you leveled up, and then I'll probably take you off of soldier duty. I don't think, don't think I need another soldier just yet. What are you guys? You're a builder. Oh, great! So it looks like they finished filling in all of that grass, like all the way around. Interesting. That went pretty quick. Um, my bricks are a little bit low, so some of you are going to be back to mining. <laughs> uh, Tiago. Uh, couple, and I'll go back to just Wade is my level 20 builder and a good carpenter. But I don't need a carpenter that often, do I? Do I? Dig that up and that up. Yeah. All right. So all of this, yeah, I, I gotta prettify this. Prettyify it. go that ought to do and then we construct brown pavestone just leave it at that for this moment there you go thank you get that out of my way be glad when there's I'll be glad when there's stairs to uh Finish this all up. Let's dig this out. Okay. Great. So, uh, yeah, the grass being put in is all finished up. Uh, you can see over here, this is what it looks like now. Uh, I have to do a little bit of tweaking just to fit the walls in, but for the most part, it is ready. It's just a, yeah, like I said, just a couple of little things to do. But I am working on, as you can see, putting nice grass and paths and stuff up here. Okay, beautiful. Roads, put that back. So that I can take this side off. <laughs> if only I thought ahead. Dig in, dig in. There we go, great. And down here, you can see I finished that all off, except for that little bit. Oh, did they finish? Oh, they went all the way over here already. Nice. Construct my path. And there, beautiful. I'm glad this path, it like connects it even on different levels. So that's a nice change. So uh, I had some skeletons attack overnight. It was no problem for like the patrol pathing guards to you know, just take them out. And it was Brunhilde took a tiny bit of damage. Nothing especially notable though. 
All right, roads. Just shuffling the pieces around. So, I don't have a terribly ton. Oh, you know what? I almost forgot. Now that, uh, what's her name? Allison? Yes. So, this is not the normal naming episode, but I had the request in time for it. So, I'm going to go ahead and f take care of this right away. Um, right here. You're no longer named Allison. You are named Blonde Sarge. Confirm. Welcome to the settlement, Blon. I'm glad I got that in. Uh, from here on out, I'm going to be strapped for people to name. I can tell you that I, you know. Um, yeah, I, I've named everybody. That's it. I don't have any more people. So, we're going to have to just wait for migrants on all of that. But, I will still keep the list going, just in case. You never know if I get a rush of migrants. Huddled masses, yearning to breathe free, etc., etc. Oh, I thought I was going to get attacked there. So I do need to start working on this road. Um, and I don't mean just this part, but a merchant. Like, the whole thing. Like, across, across the lands, I need to work on it. There we go. Uh, let's take that. There we go. Looking super good. If I turn this off, yeah, that's looking really pretty nice there. Oh, a spider has been spotted by Get Funked! The woodchopper, I guess? Yeah, Get Funked the woodchopper. Alright. Merchant. Let's do this. Let's do this. Trader. Great. Buy four short sword for four coin. Yeah, sure. Good enough. 18 corn seed. Ooh, that's close, excuse me, but I am should be growing it, so I should be able to uh, handle that. Buy two leather boots for eight coin. Oh, yeah. Yeah, why not? That's nice. Buy six gambeson for, for 12 coin. For 12 coin, yeah, sure. He's in a buying mood today. So 143 copper ore. All right, I still have 118, but that seems like a pretty good deal. I'll accept it. And, oh, what was that? Did someone kill a spider? Someone must have killed a spider. I oh, Get Funks killed the spider. I don't know where you went, man. Down there? So now my metals are pretty dang full. That's the merchant, yes. Thank you, trader. Back to farmer. Cool. All right. Now I can finish designating these roads. Did I? I only had one builder, and they probably went to sleep, didn't they? Construction flooring. Uh, paved stone. So there we have it. Oops, road and right there. I want to get rid of that. Great. All right. So yeah, there's my builder. Did I just not? 
That's pretty strange. I don't know how that got missed. Anywho, so yeah, road's coming along. Oh, this level's coming along up here. Uh, I gotta figure out where the path should go. Hmm. And once I get that stone all taken out, then I can start putting, I think I'm gonna do houses up here. This is gonna be mostly houses. Should be a nice little place. Everybody could have like kind of their own place or their own bed at least. Yeah, it'll be great. It will be great. So at this point, I actually, it was fairly uneventful night and I've got a lot of, oh, we fell up on brick, so I should be designating more walls. But uh, yeah, we're still um, pretty uneventful day. We've had a couple of spiders, a couple of skeletons, but nothing that everybody couldn't handle. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and cut this episode off. Um, I, I, I'd like to have more to talk about and I didn't have a chance to prep very much this week and you might notice that you know, I, I kind of go up and down on the uh, amount of stuff to do here, that there's a lot of waiting in timber and stone. And I'm gonna try to cut that out more or less. Um, yeah, you don't need to, don't need to be terribly boring. So I won't make you watch me designate and etc. all this. Yeah, that one's gotta go. And then that goes and that goes, okay. There we go. Yeah, just gotta make a nice smooth spot for walls to go all along. Okay, let me get down here too. Why not? Great. Is that flat? Yeah, that's flat. So then down here, that's not. Okay, great. That's good, that's good, that's good. That goes. And that goes. And that goes. There. I have to do it the whole way round, I believe. Yep. So, thanks everybody for watching. Uh, we'll have much more progress by the next time. Clearly, this wall is going to be built up, and at that point, once I get this wall like two, even two blocks high, I can move my uh, soldiers over to just guard positions at the gate, and we're gonna really, it's gonna be you know really much easier to keep everybody safe. For the most part, no one's going to leave the castle to do their job. So I will see you all in the next video. Hope everyone has a good weekend. And I'll see you next time in Timber and Stone. Hey, everybody. Welcome back real quick. I just saw we got a wolf spotted. And by Cameron Vanier, Vanier however you want to say that, I don't care. Um, because that has brought to my attention, you know, first I thought, hey, a little cool, we'll watch a wolf attack. Might be a couple of wolves here, see how it goes. It's just the one, but it also brought to my attention that this is apparently the person is still named Cameron. And looking at my list, that would seem, let me just double check here, to indicate that I somehow missed out Connor. So I am, oops, weird. Um, I apologize there, Connor. I don't know how I skipped that one. Um, this must have happened in the last episode or something. Maybe it didn't save right. I don't know. Maybe I just missed it, which I'm suspecting more is the case. So Connor, I'm going to give him just the B. So yeah, weird. Uh, but double check my list because I didn't remember anyone requesting Cameron and I knew that everybody was named. So Connor B, there you are. Infantry Congrats. Let's see how you do with a wolf. Oh, you run away. Man. Come back here. Come on. Seriously. Seriously. Connor. Connor. There you are. No, yes. Yes. That's it. Stinking wolf. Get the wolf. Get the wolf. The wolf is afraid of you. Chase the wolf down. Yes. Yeah, so close, so close. Oh, oh, he's confused, he juked you. Oh my gosh, it's the never ending wolf chase. <laughs> How laden are you? You're only eight encumbered. Come on, man, pick it up. Do you have a weak back? No, you're charismatic though, so that wolf should come when you call. 
Oh, another wolf. Is that what I'm seeing? I presume so. Yes, another wolf. Oh, and another wolf. Okay. This is looking a little more da- Bam, dead. Maybe not a little more dangerous. A few wolves, though. A whole pack. Indeed. I think most people in the village should have no problem with this. Oh, come on. Come on. Get him. Get him. Ugh. These wolves are so damn fast. Oh, now who's- Uh, who else? Murazor. Murazor. Murazor? I'm sorry. I'm trying to follow the pronunciation guide for this, and I'm really not great with pronunciation guides. <laughs> Murazor. I think that's essentially right. So there we go. Murazor. Oh, and now also Brunhilda. Oh, good. You're rested up. And Connor has decided that he's killed enough wolves for one day and is going to go chill out. And that sounds good to me, man. Sounds good to me. So, little tiny addendum there when that weird name popped up on the wolf attack. So, thanks everybody again, once again, for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. They're, they're never gonna catch this wolf, are they? Oh, so close. Brunhilda won't give up. She's even more encumbered. Oh, oh! I want the wolf attack because they're afraid of the milk. <laughs>